Cheeky Richo's No Cook Strawberry Jam. Hi and welcome to Cheeky Richo's No Cook Strawberry Jam. Today we will be making the strawberry jam with chia seeds, some fructose or sweet addin is the brand of it, and some fresh strawberries. We're going to blitz it all up in a little magic bullet and chill it overnight so that the chia seeds that are chopped up actually thicken the jam. So there's no added sugar as such. You could use other artificial sweeteners if you like, but this is 100% natural. So three ingredients into the magic bullet and off we go. I'm just going to, not using those, they're just for show. I'm just going to cut these strawberries into you know, eights, quarters, whatever you feel like. Pop them into the magic bullet and continue with the rest. The strawberries all chopped up, we're going to add our fructose and our chia seeds and we're going to blitz these up. Now we're going to have to do these in bursts because there's no liquid in there until the strawberries chop up some and this is not going to keep like normal jam. You'll only be able to keep it for like a week or so but it's great to spread on scones, pikelets, pancakes, fillings for cakes and whatnot because it doesn't have the keeping properties that cooked jam would have. But let's try it. Now it's going to be really quite liquefied, but the chia seeds will thick it enough to be able to spread. And they don't have a particular flavour, so we're just going to scrape off the excess and put a lid on it. I'm just going to leave it in the container that it's in and pop it into the fridge. And tomorrow we'll have a look at it. So I just push down the jam, the gluten-free, pectin-free jam, or artificial pectin-free jam, and that's what you have. Wow, tastes nice. Okay, there you have it. Cheeky Richo's No Cook Strawberry Jam. You're only using three ingredients, all 100% natural, and we're going to pop it in the fridge and try it tomorrow when it's set. So here's our No Cook Strawberry Jam. It's set significantly, but I wouldn't call it actually a jam. And we're going to use it as a topping on top of our strawberry sorbet. So there's a double hit of strawberries there. I hope you enjoyed this little cooking demonstration. If you would like to see more interesting recipes and ideas, just check out our Cheeky Richo channel. And don't forget to please subscribe. And do come back and visit us again soon. We have so much more to show you and we're uploading lots of videos every week. And thank you very much for watching. Have a lovely day. There we have a triple load of strawberry, a strawberry rose on top of our no-cook strawberry jam and our strawberry sorbet. Perfect for you strawberry lovers out there.